stop the beating jack Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is just Total Man 21 here, and this is a video. Or this is a video on a wager match, which is one of my most prized possession wager matches of all time. Um, this is my uh, amazing game-winning kill wager match. Um, if you ever watch my intro, it's uh, it's the kill in that hint hint in the balcony, double hint hint. Um, it, for my intro, actually talking about that on the topic, um, the music on that is actually a custom uh, dubstep if I pronounce that right, uh, remix that one of my buds made. His name is Mummy200. Mummy200. Mummy um, if I remember correctly, I'll probably post uh, some sort of annotation on the screen that will uh, lead you to his channel. You should sub to him. He's a pretty cool kid, and he has an epic voice. So, you know, that's all good. Now, uh, today I'm going to be commenting over this video, and uh, I, got a, I got a request from Apple Jacks. It says, Hey, Tup, man, I'm a big fan, and I would like to hear your opinion on Modern Warfare 3. I would like to know if you are looking forward to playing it, or if you're not looking forward to it. Please do a commentary on this topic. Thanks. Well, Apple Jacks and the rest of the world who uh, give, gives two shits about what I think. Um, I am actually looking forward to Modern Warfare 3 more than uh, more than most people would think. Because uh, I am a pretty big Black Ops fan. I do play it very often, and I, I don't consider myself a hardcore tryhard, but... I, I can do a, I can pull off like a 3.0 KD in a game. With uh, with ease, but uh, I've been kind of getting sick of Black Ops lately because there's all of the campers and the noobs and stuff, and I'm kind of looking forward to a kind of like a new uh, I don't know how to say it, like a new refreshment of a game type. And uh, I I I've been going back to my to the older Call of Duties I have like Modern Warfare 2, and uh, I I absolutely hate it because there's always the one dude who has uh, the like the tar with a grenade launcher and the explosive perk that makes you do more explosive damage at one-man army pro. Yeah, it's not fun at all. And then I actually went back to COD 5 a couple of days ago, and I pulled off... I was playing a team deathmatch, and I went 46-5, and five, and I just owned these kids with my MP40 with extended mag. So uh, I actually haven't played World at War in quite a while, because the last time I played on it, it was uh, it was hacked to shit. Every single game, there would be uh, at least a good four or five hackers in the lobby, and they'd just keep calling in dogs, and they'd float through the air and kill me and stuff. So I, I kind of put it down for a long time, and I can't remember why I picked it up. I just kind of think I felt like doing it. So, uh, yeah, I'm kind of looking forward to Modern Warfare 3. I'm looking forward to all the new stuff. I mean, there's all, there's all the hype out there, you know? I mean, you can't say that like, you're not a little bit excited. I did... I did pre-order the hardened edition. I'll be getting it on the Tuesday. I'm not one of those guys who's gonna get to who's gonna get it early, but I, I'm gonna be one of the guys who will be posting out content on it. So uh, stay tuned for that if you want to see me do some good in uh, in Modern Warfare 3. Look at this sexy no scope slow motion. Oh right. But I'm I'm definitely looking forward to Modern Warfare 3. I definitely want to see them like nerf like the grenade launchers. I kind of want Modern Warfare 3 to be like a fixed Modern Warfare 2 version. If that makes sense to you guys. Like, I want to take out, like, the second chance and the one-man army and the commando and all of those perks. I mean, don't don't get me wrong. I mean, I do use commando and one-man army, but I, I'd rather have them taken out because I get killed with that perk more than I kill people while I'm using it. So, yeah, I'm looking forward. I'm looking forward to spec ops. I'm looking forward to all the new weapons. I'm, and and people have been telling me that it that it, the feel of it is a lot like COD 4 and Modern Warfare 2 combined. And uh, I have I've never played COD 4 before, so and people tell me that it was like the best game in Call of Duty history, and uh, I, I'm kind of looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to the guns. I'm looking forward to uh, ranking up quickly. I'm looking forward to playing with some of my friends and seeing how good or bad they are and how they how they like the game. I want to see people's first impressions. I want to I'm I'm going to be looking up some debated topics of whether it's good or whether it's bad. Um, I might do a like a dual con with some of my friends over a gameplay of whether they like it or not in uh, probably two or three weeks after it comes out and get their first reactions to it. I don't know, leave me a comment below. Should I do a dual con with three or five people? And letting them know how they think the game is going so far? 
Uh, I am kind of bummed out, though, that Zombies is not going to be Modern Warfare 3. i got to give it that. And there's my 36 plus 6 knife. I'm awesome. I'm kind of bummed, though, that there's no Zombies, but I, I hear that Spec Ops is going to be amazing. So I think I think that'll replace it, but nothing will ever really replace Zombies for me. I'm a major Zombie fan. All the Zombie maps on a Black Ops, I absolutely love them. I'm a pretty big pro. My highest round is like 54, and that was with one of my really true friends who would basically just commit suicide at the beginning of every round, and I'd just run around with a Thunder Gun and the Ray Gun, or the Wonder Waffle and Ray Gun, and just do work. And we actually had to quit because he had to go to bed, so I don't know how, how far we could have gotten up. So that is my thoughts on Modern Warfare 3. I am very much looking forward to it. So uh, please let me know your opinions on the, in the doobly-doo down below. Comment, rate, like, and subscribe, and as always, have a wonderful day.